Okay, so real quick, this is how we use the CM fixer slash reinstaller script that uh, we threw together for some hung up clients. Um, basically, we start off with a retry function, a retry command function that uh, takes a script block, uh, maximum number of retries, and how many seconds you want each delay to be. Uh, then we take the CM exec service and we uh, disable it. So basically, if somebody runs this, then it doesn't work and they restart the computer and run it again, that will prevent CM exec from ever starting, uh, which will really increase your chances of success. Um, so then once we've done that, we do a while loop uh, where we try to stop the service. Um, if it takes more than three tries to stop the service, then we try a more aggressive method where we get the process ID for the process and kill the process. Um, once we're sure that it's stopped, uh, we stop the WMI. Um, and that sometimes takes two tries, so that um, we try that twice. And then there's a while loop where we basically, as long as the CM setup executable is found, we try to uninstall uh, CM client. It, we check to see if it's still there after the fifth try. If it is, we just we kill the program. Um, assuming that it has successfully uninstalled, we try to delete all of the folders uh, in, in C Windows for Config Manager, so CCM, CCM Setup, and CCM Cache. And that sometimes takes a few tries, so we try that a maximum of three times, uh, taking a 10-second delay each time. Then we take a good 30-second break uh waiting for you know any rogue process to stop or or rogue folder deletion to actually happen sometimes these things just get hung up after those 30 seconds we reinstall config manager client and then we wait uh five minutes for it to kind of check in with the server and then um in this particular case the machine policy evaluated on its own before this, but after five minutes, we evaluate the machine policy so that the computer can start talking to CM, um, get any deployments that it's missing, stuff like that. So here you can see we've deleted the folders. Uh, the script is checking. Sees the folders are gone. Runs the installer from the network. CCM setup folder reappears. There's CCM and CCM cache are back. At this point, the client is basically reinstalled <clears throat> and you'll see on the left in the PowerShell window, we will start to be able to talk to the service again. And in just a few moments, um, I want to say two minutes, we'll see a little pop-up window that says we have software available from Software Center. And when you see that, you know you're back in business.